Let's shake it. Yeah, it's never been on camera. <laughs> Doesn't know what I'm doing. Tiny park. I sure did like visiting here. <laughs> this one's nice. Yeah, it's got paper on the floor. I want you to take a picture of me. Pretending to control this thing. It's a laptop. <laughs> wow, it's really high tech now. Yeah, they don't even use steering wheels. Look at this. How do you control This is zoom, this is focus. Okay. Hazel. How you doing, Jake? Pretty good. Hazel? You do? Good. Hazel? <laughs> <laughs> How yeah. are you doing, Lucas? I'm doing super good today. <laughs> There's a bunch of stuff in the airport. an airplane. No, no, okay. oh, no. Oh, we've been waiting for how long, Jake? I have no idea. Woo. But it's fine. They're just trying to figure out some kind of computer thing. Write something down. I know. It's been taking at least 20 minutes. Uh, oh, yeah. I have this thing right here, which hurts a lot. This, yeah. I scratched up. Uh, well, we don't know what we're doing right now. It, it's pretty boring, but... I just think you should always be recording. You're also really close. You should zoom out like that. Yeah. So I don't know what we're doing right now. Um, I don't either. This is... Now it's been another 10 minutes. We don't know what to do now. Shout out to Jacob. For letting me use this camera. Okay, so Hazel. You can print that and you're oh. Take a picture Waiting for Hazel. So what are you doing, uh, Hazel? Nothing. Are you sure you're doing nothing? Wait. Oh, what are you trying to do? Oh, this? On Jacob's leg? Yep. Well, you're, you're doing a good job, I guess.
My watch just broke. It's not even ticking. So my plan was to come out here and look at the Golden Gate Bridge as the sunset, but one, I'm too late, and two, fog. So much fog. I can still try and get that way, but I don't think so. It's getting cold and it's getting dark. Thank you, Gap, for being literally everywhere and always carrying sweaters. Maybe I'll try and go back? I mean, I'm so close, though. Hazel lives in the sort of normal Chinese part of San Francisco. So to come to the fancy white part is super strange. All the signs are in English and it sounds awful, but like there's just white people everywhere. It does not feel like San Francisco. Just like um, Pure 39 yesterday felt like, like a Disneyland version of San Francisco. This feels kind of like a different, just feels wrong. The little markets have heirloom tomatoes instead of lychee and duck. This is hilarious. <laughs> Their old movie theater is still a movie theater and not a Walgreens. Yeah, it's like I'm in some kind of alternate San Francisco where everyone's white and straight and 26. I wonder what they're all doing. I wonder what they're, how can they all afford to live here? And why is it so clean? Hazel's coming to pick me up, but I, I moved. I was in downtown white neighborhood, whatever it's called. And then I decided to go look at the, there's like some kind of Coliseum thing over there. So they, they, they missed me. I moved. I was too, I moved. I'll stay here. I'm gonna stay right here. <laughs> right at the edge of the street so everyone can see me. This street is too big. I tried to cross it and by the time I got halfway across the light changed. I was on the right side of the street the whole time. I crossed the wrong street. I went the wrong... I can literally see where I'm going. And it's right there. I will be there in one minute though, Hazel. Just hang on. I thought I'll just look I'll just go look at the big round thing while I'm waiting for them to show up. But it was too far, and now I've crossed the wrong street. I'm a disaster. I'm a straight up disaster. Very imposing. Kind of like a reproduction coliseum. These are very imposing. Wow. Hi. Yeah, it is beautiful. It's hard to show how big it is, though. <laughs> kind of right hard now. to illustrate how big it is. Kind of like St. Peter's. So